In this video, I just wanted to highlight a couple of other features you have within your class notebook toolbar in your OneNote class notebook. If you come down over to the right to these icons that are on the right, you have a few that could come in handy, particularly as the course of the school year goes on, is the ability to add or remove students. So if you have additional students that enter your class mid-year and you need to add them to your notebook, this provides a little shortcut to access it. So again, this is under the class notebook toolbar. And then when you click on this, it's going to open up a web browser and it's going to bring you basically to Office 365, the online version of creating a class notebook. And now it's asking me which notebook do I want to add or remove students. So I'm going to look for the notebook that I have currently open and I'm going to click on it. You can see here I have my test student as the only person enrolled. If I wanted to remove this student, I could click the X. And I also would have the ability to delete their content. But if I wanted to add an additional student, I just need to type in a few letters of their first or last name, and then you should get a populated list of people to select from. Keep in mind, if this is a brand new student and they have not been added to your Office 365 database, that might be why you don't see them in the list that pops up. So then all I'm going to do is select the person that I want to add. If you needed to add additional students, you could do that here. And again, you just click on once you find the correct name and you go through that entire process. Once you have the students that you want to add, you can go ahead and click next. And then the final step is to click update. Once you have clicked update, that is then going to create your student and it's going to put them into their notebook, your notebook, and they will be able to access the notebook by logging into Office 365 for the first time. The other thing that you can do is add or remove teachers. So if we go back over to OneNote for Windows 10, you will see an icon next to the one we were just at. Over here, you're going to click Add or Remove Teachers. So if you have a special area teacher or an inclusion teacher that you want to add to your notebook to give them full access to the notebook, you can do the same thing, very similar to adding a student. And you're just going to scroll down and you're going to look for the notebook where you want to add that teacher. And you're going to get a very similar box here and you're just going to type in the name of the teacher that you want to add. You will click next and then you will hit update. Once you hit update, when you add a teacher to a notebook, they will get an email notification that the notebook has been shared with them and they will be able to open that notebook up directly from their email or they can log it into Office 365 and they can find it in OneDrive in the shared option. So these are just a couple of quick management tips of your notebook that you can find in the class notebook toolbar in the OneNote for Windows 10 app.